the Hebrew concept of atonement is called tshuva. And the word tshuva in Hebrew means two things. One is the way back of a person from a place that he went to. So the path of coming back to where he came out from is called tshuva. And as well, tshuva means an answer. So two amazing points on that word that represents atonement in Hebrew. One is that you should not judge yourself in a negative way and hating yourself for who you are today, your condition, your life situation. Because the fact is that you came from a holy place and your root is highly and precious. And the word tshuva that shows that you are on your way back if you will just focus on correcting yourself and becoming the real, true, honest person you are, this concept is revealing to us that our root is in holiness and in purity. And the path is to come back to who we really are, to where we started from. That's one. And Shuvadat is an answer, is also a very relaxing and amazing, deep understanding about that concept of atonement. When a person is falling and failing in his life, he falls into a place of doubts, of questions, of many, many lackings in his understanding of his own life. What am I doing here? What's going on? Why is it happening to me? And the concept of tshuva that is an answer is supplying a great understanding to all of us that the real essence of our being depends on one thing and it's tshuva, that there is an answer to all our questions. You have many questions, but there is one answer to it. And it's to come back to who you really are, to come back to Hashem, to your soul, to the root of your soul, to become the precious and pure and holy and highly one that you are. Remembering that brings a lot of comfort and deep understanding for the fact we have hope that we have a chance to complete our process of atonement, to complete our tshuva and to become in our true potential as great as we really are. Good luck.